At 8 a.m. today, ambulances and medical workers were stationed at three nucleic acid testing points in the neighborhood. Since the residents had recently been tested twice, the process went much more smoothly and efficiently today. I was notified to take the test at 10.30 a.m., but actually finished at 9.40. Everyone knew exactly what to do. Neighborhood committee members, volunteers, police and medical workers worked together to prevent overcrowding and maintain order. A path at the neighborhood's southwest gate was reserved for ambulances to enter and exit. Samples were taken to a nearby hospital in the ambulances. In some cases, people were tested at home. For those who are unable to go to testing sites, such as seniors with dementia and paralyzed people, medical workers went door to door to take their samples. Peng Hui, a DD driver who was accidentally stuck in the neighborhood, has been working as a volunteer during the lockdown. I was helpless at first, but now I've made friends with people here. I'm grateful for their help, and I hope they can resume their normal lives soon. About 6,000 residents tested negative during the first two tests. If all of today's test results are negative, the lockdown will end this Friday. The first confirmed patient of Shanghai's recent locally transmitted cases was discharged last Sunday. So far, there are six locally transmitted cases under treatment in hospital. Zhang Hong, Shanghai Life.